to Vlogmas Day 16 where I am so excited and I'm going to be doing an ugly I'm sweater gonna... party! going to go out and buy a sweater for this party but not this one I'm going to make my own DIY ugly sweater because the uglier the better right I, I think so now by a show of hands at home how many of you are not familiar with an ugly sweater party you in the back there you didn't raise your hand so I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about this and why your mind will be blown ugly sweaters are those things that your great aunt used to like make for you and she'd knit them by hand and they would just be hideous and nobody really wanted to be seen in them. Well, somewhere along the line, this became the cool way to celebrate parties with your friends. Whoever has the ugliest usually wins a prize. It's just really fun. And now they're so mainstream that you can get them at every major retailer. But wait, why would you spend $20 to $40 on a sweater that's ugly that you're going to wear maybe to one holiday party when you could make your own out of a sweater that you already find semi-ugly at home? For example, this. Yeah. As always, there's going to be a close-up cam so you can see what I'm doing up close and personal. I'm not going to talk you through the process because everybody's going to make their own ugly sweater and it's going to be unique. You can put lights on them. You can put bells on them. The uglier, the better. is so dull and let's face it you don't want to see your friends walking out the door after being there for only a little bit so I've decided to create all sorts of fun stuff so my friends will have stuff to do and it'll look fun and festive and just as interesting as this sweater so the first thing that I did was I picked up some just little games that they can play these are easy games they're trivia games you can find them in so many different styles this one's just a movies one this one's a 90s one because well I'm old and they also have like fun ones that you can add drinking themes to so your friends can all be happy. Yeah, that'll keep them there for a while. In what music video is R.E.M. stuck in traffic? Orange Crush? Everybody Hurts? Or Man in the Moon? What music icon inquired, how can you just leave me standing alone in a world so cold? How can you leave me standing alone in a world that's so cold, 
What kind of animal is Rafiki? The circle of life! Next up, I'm going to create a wonderful time for my friends so that they can commemorate their awesome sweater party adventure by creating a photo frame. I think these are just really fun and they give you that little punch of Christmas that you might be lacking at your party. Especially if you don't want to go all out and decorate your entire place, a few little touches like this can go a long way. Now to create your own DIY photo frame, you're going to need a piece of foam board. The larger the better because that means you're going to be able to put more people behind it. You're also going to need some uh, paper, any kind of paper. I like to do bright and bold because let's face it, we're already a little crazy, why not just add to it? we have it all cut out for us to wrap it. You can do this in a variety of different ways. It really is up to you. The main thing is you just want to cover the frame somehow. some little embellishments around it if we choose. Now imagine if you will that perfect photo opportunity at your party that everyone talks about and looks forward to every single year and then you're missing something. What are you missing though? Hmm. You know what you're missing? You're missing something really fun. You are missing holiday props. those super cool photos, what are we going to do with them? Well, we're probably going to stagger them across our social media, have a little bit of fun tagging one another, but why should it have to stop there? It shouldn't! We should totally be able to celebrate our amazing, ugly holiday sweater party for the year. The entire year. They have these things now that are called uh, ugly sweater frames. That's right, you can take this and you can decorate either your tree with it, you can send it with a uh, holiday card, or you can slap a magnet on it and stick it right to your refrigerator. Yep, that's probably what I'm going to be doing with mine. Thanks guys for coming by and checking out episode 16 of Vlogmas! Make sure you stop back in tomorrow to see what exactly I'm preparing to eat because our food should not be ugly, only our sweaters should. I'll see you guys tomorrow and I hope you have a Merry Christmas. Bye! Which city does 1984's Ghostbusters take place in? <laughs>